Our top story at 5.30. Live pictures right now from Port Canaveral. It is ready to become America's first liquid natural gas cruise port. The port is now home to a new barge. Fox 35's Alina Shirazi got a look at how this new tool will work. This has been a, a four-year project from concept to uh, reality. The Carnival Mardi Gras ship set to begin sailing from Port Canaveral will be the first cruise ship in America to be powered by liquid natural gas. In its liquid state, LNG is a more environmentally friendly and less expensive fuel choice. LNG, in my opinion, is the future fuel for marine transportation. Um, and like Wayne said, it's a domestically sourced fuel that we, we have in abundance in the U.S. Um, the vessel you see here carries 4,000 cubic meters. That's about 1 million gallons of LNG. And that'll be enough to supply two cruise ships. Behind me, you can see the barge that will provide the natural gas fuel for ships in the near future. As we load the fuel, it's constantly monitoring the quality of the gas. Verrett says they get the fuel from Georgia, then it takes six to eight hours to finish loading up the ship. We load through the upper manifold. Um, at Elba Island, they have large loading arms that connect up top. And then on the other side, I'll show you, but the lower graded level right here is where we connect the hose and we'll pass the hose from here to the cruise ship. And Murray says it's smooth sailing from there. We're excited to be the first. Uh, it's always nice to get ahead of the curve. And coming up at 6, how this natural gas will be used across industries. At Port Canaveral, Alina Shirazi, Fox 35 News.